J.R. Castro is a, a young guy from North Town of Las Vegas who loves to sing. I love R&B music. I got a mixtape dropping called Songs You Were Made To, and then I also got an EP coming called You. Um, also, I got a single right now on the radio titled Get Home featuring Kitty and uh, Migos. Oh man, it was an uh, like an out of earth experience, man. He's an alien. That's what I call him, man. He's 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 great. He's inspiring, uh, and he just uh, he knows how to really elevate uh, one's you know perspective, especially uh, on their approach to music. I would love to work with. I know this is gonna sound crazy. I would love to work with Quincy Jones. You know, old school vet. I really love Michael Jackson and a lot of. Uh, you know, I'm inspired by Mike, so I would love to work with Quincy Jones. Seventh Street is my homegirl, man. So it came. You know, we, I had this song and I heard her on it. And I was like, yo, come through. She came through for me, man. And shout out to Polo Dodani, who produced the song. Shout out to YG, who was also on the song. Uh, they just, they heard the song, man, and they loved it. I heard them on it and they just, they loved it too. So it was a, it was a great mesh. Yeah, I, I really wanna, uh, I would love to work with Kalani. You know, she's, uh, she, she's dope. She's from the Bay Area, she's super dope. I think R&B is confused. I don't think it's dead, I just think it's confused. I think that uh, because hip hop is so dominant, you know, that the R&B guys are trying to, you know, figure out a way. It's like this, I feel like R&B now is, is rap melody, it's rap lyrics sung over R&B melodies. You know what I mean? Which takes away from the essence of R&B, the true core of R&B. That's what I feel about it. I just think it's confused. A lot, I mean, the music scene in Vegas, it's great. It's just that uh, you know you get so, you know, blinded by all the lights and uh, the, the Vegas attraction that you know people don't really pay attention to that part of Vegas. But it's really it's really a lot of talented people out there.